It is NBA action on EA Sports. I'm Ed Cohen. Great to be joined by Jay Williams. Should be a terrific game here tonight. We are at United Center in the Windy City. Tonight, the Chicago Bulls taking on the Denver Nuggets. The Nuggets control the tap. Ed, I'm going to gloat about my old team here for a second. Did you know the Bulls are the only NBA franchise to win multiple championships and never lose an NBA final series in their history? 6-0 right now. It helped to have a guy named MJ. But, Jay, think about this. If he's not gone those two seasons, maybe it's eight straight finals wins. Oh, nice find for the basket. Look, there was barely any contact on that last play. I agree with the refs, no call. Let him play. And count the basket inside. Attack mode isn't a switch that you can just turn on and off. He needs to do more of that. We need to see him penetrate, get into that lane, and create. Nuggets have the possession. There's a pass stolen by Chicago. Taking advantage of the turnover. I don't know if the scouting report has made its way out here yet, but if anything, it says you need to not let him get that close to the rim. Murray into the front court, trailing by four to Miles Bridges. Nice pace, sets it up, and slams it down. It's that easy, Ed. You never want to leave any doubt when attacking the rim. Oh, highlight moves. Tough to do with the defender all over you. Yes, and a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. So many times we get on the defender for quote-unquote letting the offensive player score on an and one. Sometimes there's a lucky bounce, but more often than not, it's the offensive player who makes the play happen despite the defender's best intentions. throw good to finish off the three-point play. The lead is up to five. Nuggets with the basketball. Down low, Jokic. Finishing inside the paint on that one. And sometimes less is more. Keeping it simple is the best way. Yes, and the foul. And a chance at three coming up. Oh, he should get some kind of acting award. That's a great sell by the offensive player. But guess what? The ref spit, and that's the game. Good as he completes the three-point play. The lead is up to six. Murray with it. He'll run the offense. Great feed. Sets it. Stuffs it down with authority. Mm-hmm. We call that get your money and put it in the bank. <laughs> to Chris Dunn. Oh, emphatic slam. Jay, they've had no answer for this guy. He's been on fire this first quarter. That's the way you take it right to your opponent. You attack right out of the game. To Miles Bridges. Thaddeus Young rejects it. Chicago possession. Count the basket at the rim. They're going to have to find answers defensively and quickly because he's carving them up in the first quarter. Jay Nikola Jokic, he's never made the playoffs, but upon further review, he is a special center. Got that five-year extension for $146 million, and I'm going to say this, he will be one of the future centers in the game. 
And the reward? A couple of shots at the line. You see this all the time. The defensive player is establishing his presence on the court and also checking to see how far the refs are going to let him go. First free throw is good. Two for two on that trip. Denver ball right now. Great look and vision. Miles Bridges slams it down. Jay, perhaps that's a start. Those kind of plays get me fired up. That's a momentum play. They look lifeless here in the first quarter, but a dunk like that can get your team going in the right direction. To Will Barton. Miles Bridges trying to cash in. Wide open look, won't go. That's called a heat check right there. Surprised he missed that one. That was an open look. And count the basket. Showing you why he belongs here in this league with the best of the best. Efficient scoring out of the rookie here tonight. Martin into the front court. Down 12. To Miles Bridges. Fires the three. Very little's gone right in this first quarter, but with that three, you look at the scoreboard, they're back within nine. And Ed Rome was not built in one day. You can't rush the process. Just keep chipping away. Chip, chip, chip. Martin into the front court. Down 11. To Miles Bridges. Yes, and a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. And I love the smile on the face of the offensive player. Sometimes luck is on your side. I don't know how that shot went in, but and one. to finish off the three-point play. And the margin down to eight. To Wendell Carter. Wendell Carter powers it through. They have set the tone in this one. I love when I see offenses come out in beast mode. You attack that paint, you get to the rim, inevitably the floor will open up for you to knock down some threes. Miles Bridges to Will Barton. Beyond the arc for three. They'll take it from downtown. Let's see, Jay, if that wakes them up. Yeah, that was a big time three, but the most important possession is now, the one you're currently in. Don't focus on the next play, but focus on the present. Short jumper won't fall. I'm not sure that the contest on the shot contributed to the miss, but what it might have done is seep into the confidence of the shooter that the next time he might decide to try to drive to the rim instead of settling for a jump. Short jumper off the mark. Ah, oh, the monster stuff. I mean, defense, is it that easy? Can I see some reaction after somebody gets an easy dunk, some yelling, some kind of emotion? I need you to get involved back in this ballgame. To Miles Bridges, driving right to the basket. Barton. Nice pass to set things up. But most importantly, you have to keep the ball moving. Maybe run some floppy sets, some horn sets. Raise those bigs up, which open up the lane, and let them be the passers to make plays easier for the guards. Murray with the basketball. Less than a minute to go in a tightly played first quarter. Here comes the screen to Miles Bridges. And he finishes at the rim. That's what I'm talking about, Ed. It's that simple. Put the ball in the bucket. Stuffs it down with authority. That's called a grown man play, Ed. Someone's trying to get featured on Sports Center tonight. Denver's got it. Stop. 
surveys the floor. To Miles Bridges. Oh, Carter with the rejection. That's why a rim protector is a necessity in this game. Give him two points. High percentage. I like that aggression early. You never just settle for jumpers. You attack, you attack, you attack. Then when they back off, you'll have room to shoot that, Jay. Laurie marketing. Huge block. Tough looking shot there. Still gets it to go down. Just inside the arc, at the buzzer. First one goes down. No good on the second. It's a one of two trip. One quarter in the books here on Christmas Day. Jay and I are back after this. It's a special presentation of the NBA on EA Sports. with you as we get things started here in the second quarter. Chicago basketball. To Young. To Markinen. Here's a chance from long range. This young man with a great stroke, even when it's well defended. Ed, let me tell you how this one goes. It ain't no fun if the homies can't have some. Everyone's getting a piece of the rock tonight. Miles Bridges. To Will Barton. Here comes the screen. Barton. Has a look. Murray's shot won't fall. Scores from the post. You feel that? I see the confidence building. Murray into the front court. His guys currently down by 13. To Will Barton. Tight space with the crossover to Will Barton. Has a chance. Barton shot off the mark. Marking it to Young. Deep right corner. Five to shoot for the Bulls. Deep two there, won't go. See, when good shooters catch, they just shoot. When bad shooters catch, they become hesitant, reluctant. That's the first sign of a guy that doesn't have confidence. Trying to cash in. Can't connect. On the follow. Way to stay with it. Now whistle. We'll get a timeout call by Chicago as they'll talk things over here in the second quarter.
Both teams tweaking their lineups. Here come some changes. Levine. To Wendell Carter. To Zach Levine. Marking it. Five on the shot clock. Fires the three. Misfires. It's no good. Here comes the screen. Almost unlucky bounce to Levine. area won't go down Martin's shot no good I don't know why he rushed that shot he was wide open take your time now big finish full head of steam that time he was ready right at the tip what a first half he's having he came out out of the gate attack found ways to get to the rim now look how easy the game is coming to him a oh, big finish at the rim if you didn't dunk that, then we would have to talk about it. Yes, and the foul. And a chance at three coming up. That was such a great job by the offensive player. Knowing that you're probably going to take some lumps here and there, but still remaining aggressive throughout the shot and getting a crack at the extra point. The free throw is good. Finishing off the three-point play. The lead grows to 12. Murray into the front court. Looking to make something happen. Terrific vision. Whoa! What a finish! And when you get your prescription, you take your medicine and you call it a day. Bulls with it. The crossover gets inside and the slam dunk. Hey, look, this is a new wave. If a young cat catches you sleeping on the wrong night, it's definitely going to get a million-plus views the next day. Great dish to set it up. They call a three-second violation. Layup's good. Those are the types of shots you always strive for. You normally don't see that, but that's the type of thing that keeps shooters in the league for a long time. Every once in a while, they venture into the paint. Nice pass to set things up. Throws it down. An easy two. Get back on defense. Oh, highlight moves. Tough to do with the defender all over you. To Young. Slams it down. I'll tell you what. It's impressive to watch a young player this new to the NBA not be afraid to drive to the basket. Goes a long way in establishing your presence in the league. To Miles Bridges for three. Oh, he couldn't get it to go. Leaving no doubt, slams it down. This is becoming a runaway. They're getting to the rim at will, probably because we're watching Matador defense. You probably want to get in the way of your defender if they keep trying to attack the rim. Murray with it. Down a bundle. To Millsap. Send it away! Did you see how far he got up? He kept going up and up and up. I think he's still going up. Count the basket inside. Contact on a drive can be a beautiful thing. Making those tough shots can really help you build a mental advantage over your defender. Deep 
three at the buzzer. A very one-sided first half of basketball as we are at halftime. Let's get you to our NBA Live studios in Orlando and hand it over to Jalen Rose for our EA Sports Halftime Report. Jalen. Jalen here with your halftime report. The Bulls have built a comfortable lead. It was their playmaking, the way they gave each other scoring opportunities. That really impresses me. I love seeing unselfish basketball like that. Have a look at the leading scores for the Chicago Bulls. The Nuggets did a lot of things wrong in that opening half. At this point, it's all about pride and mental toughness. A comeback is not impossible, but it's also not likely. These are the guys getting buckets for the Denver Nuggets. Chicago Bulls came to play today, and the opposition knows it. All these blocks are more than just rejections. They're statements. Player of the half. I like this choice because he really put on a show in the opening half. There's a reason he's a fan favorite. We'll be happy to be lukewarm at this point. He can't seem to get anything going. We have picked them for you. Here are the top plays. Number two. Number one. Back to you. First half, very one-sided. What will the second half bring? We'll find out as we're underway. Here we go. To Wendell Carter. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Coming through, coming through. Old school. Backs his man down for the basket. Old school equals high percentage. Nuggets have the possession. To Miles Bridges. Oh! Out there looking like the Kimbe Matumbo. Took it right to him, and the defender was ready. Millsap. Wide open look, won't go. Eight second violation. It's going the other way. to Miles Bridges. Miles Bridges slams it down. He's been a one-man show, but Jay, they're still down in this one. He's their lone bright star, their only star tonight. Some other of the supporting cast members really need to step up. And scores, strong take. When the ball's in his hands, we all knew what was gonna happen. Murray with the basketball. His guys down big. To Jokic. A oh, bad pass, and the Bulls have it. Gets a look. Can't hit. Oh, he was smothered and still gets it to go down. 
There's some players out there that like the freedom of space, and then we have the anomalies. We have the players who feel comfortable being uncomfortable, and almost the physicality of the game centers them and puts them right on balance every time. Going along, beyond the arc. Where's the chatter? No one was even close to him. I know the refs on the court all the time, but it doesn't mean they can see every play. Maybe defensively grab his jersey, step on his toe, do something to kind of change up his pace. Thaddeus Young, better late than never. That was his first shot, and it goes down. Look, there was barely any contact on that last play. I agree with the refs, no call. Let him play. They go to Jokic, down low, throws it down. This type of game needs to be celebrated. This is the type of culture that is fostered when you play with unselfish players. When you give up a little bit of yourself and you make your teammate look great, that's the difference between winning and losing. So when you see these guys smiling, when you see them giving each other high fives, that's because of the energy that was created from the pass. Pass is one of the most brilliant things we have in this game. The screen sets him up for two. Might have had an extra dribble or two there, but he got the shot he won. Finishes strong. I know there's that old saying that says one man can't beat five, but we're watching one man carry four other players. His back has to be hurting. Another big time finish. To Miles Bridges. Won't go down. Defender's lucky he wasn't called. Has a look. Knocks it down from mid range. You know, Ed, people don't understand. Tough shots are practiced every single day. With all these different contraptions out there to contest your shot, guys shoot 500 made shots a day. This is the new norm. Oh, Nikola Jokic. That's how it's done. He's four for four in the game. Attack mode isn't a switch that you can just turn on and off. He needs to do more of that. We need to see him penetrate, get into that lane, and create. And the slam. Woo! This rookie is a high flyer. He brings that kind of pro-am vibe to the NBA. And it's fun to watch. The drive right to the basket. Jamal Murray from the outside. No good. The contest was good, but you being a nuisance was great. Continue to be that knack that no matter how many times you swing at it, it never goes away. New blood coming in for both sides. Free throw good to cap off the three-point play as they continue to open things up here in the third quarter. Murray into the front court. Hey, up, He'll run up. the offense. Down to Grant. Block shot. This game is all about playing mind tricks on people. The offense is more worried about getting their shot blocked than they are about actually making the shot. Barton. The pass set it all up. In the paint, you need to finish just like that. Got him, got him. Up, to Wendell hey. Carter. Yes, and a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. And I love the smile on the face of the offensive player. Sometimes luck is on your side. I don't know how that shot went in, but and one. Substitution being made in this one. throws good as they continue to widen their lead. To Will Barton. Great feed. And watch him do the rest. Slam dunk. Jay, let's see if that's a sign for him. Well, he's been pretty much non-existent the first three quarters, but when you have a play like that, that can get the juices go. going, and that can him. help you with your offensive rhythm. Rotate, rotate. 
Make it hard on Got a piece mm. of it. Jumping out the gym right now, Ed. Great anticipation. And look out. Big finish at the rim. I mean, defense, is it that easy? Can I see some reaction after somebody gets an easy dunk? Some yelling, some kind of emotion? I need you to get involved back in this ballgame. Yes, and the foul. And a chance at three coming up. The defender was actually in a good position there. They even made a decent play on the ball. But sometimes those bounces go the other way. Still, stay aggressive out there. Coach has seen enough. He wants some changes. New personnel onto the floor. it down at the line. I got this D on him. Everybody pick up. Everybody pick up. D up. D up. Jamal Murray. Can't go down. Smothering defense. And look, sometimes you don't have it going every single night. Maybe utilize yourself as a decoy and get some teammates involved with your passing. It's Denver's ball. Return. Oh. Knocked away. It's getting dangerous down there. And I hated getting my shot blocked like that. But I did like getting the ball right back. Pace sets it up and slams it down. It's that easy, Ed. You never want to leave any doubt when attacking the rim. To Markinen. Count it. No and one. There was some contact there. He's been doing this for years, the physicality in which he plays. No one wants to see that. You're going to leave the game with black and blue marks all over your body. Nice pass to set things up. The rebound cleared by the Bulls. Converts in the paint. Nice finish at the rim. No doubt about where that one was headed. Nuggets have the possession. Down low, Plumley Cashes in for two. You know, from a point guard perspective, one of the things that I learned when I played in the league was that the more I was willing to give the ball up, the harder other players were willing to run to their spots. The harder the bigs were running to the rim. The harder the three-point shooters were running to the three-point line because they knew they could be active recipients. And when they caught the ball, they knew exactly what to do with it. Just inside the arc, at the buzzer. Third quarter comes to an end. The fourth quarter on the way. It has been all Bulls. with the basketball to start the fourth quarter. And they've really had very little go right for them on either end of the floor. Remember that old line, your attitude determines your altitude? Well, when you see dejected faces on the sideline, that poor body language gave you an impression that they had no chance to win this game. Barton. To Jokic. Great pass to set it up. Flushes it home. 
He took it out on the rim that time. Oh, there's no better feeling than after throwing that one down, hanging on the rim a little bit, looking at your opponent beneath you, making him recognize that's where you'll be the entire ball game. 4-3. Yes. Give the advantage to the shooter. It doesn't matter if it's off the dribble, off a quick pass, or off an iso. When the ball is in this young player's hands, something just feels right. Rises for the slam. This type of game needs to be celebrated. This is the type of culture that is fostered when you play with unselfish players. When you give up a little bit of yourself and you make your teammate look great, that's the difference between winning and losing. So when you see these guys smiling, when you see them giving each other high fives, that's because of the energy that was created from the pass. Pass is one of the most brilliant things we have in this game. Big finish at the rim. And when you get your prescription, you take your medicine and you call it a day. Done. Nice finish at the rim. You know, it reminds me out of a story a legendary coach once told me. He said, if you ever get in a fight, you're not going to hit somebody with an open hand, correct? You'll probably break a finger. But if you hit somebody with a fist, what is that? That's five fingers working collectively together as one. That's how you deliver a knockout punch, and that's what we're seeing tonight. To Jokic. Using the post to his advantage there and the finish at the rim. It just seems like nobody can stop him but him. Once he's found his offensive swag, I got ball. I got ball. that boy's deadly. Stuffs it down with authority. Jay, that's been the story this evening. I mean, another one? Another dunk? Another easy possession? I mean, how demoralizing can this be for the team? Why am I the only one yelling? I don't see anybody on the bench yelling. I don't see anybody on the court even angry right now. Both coaches hitting the reset button. Fresh legs coming onto the floor. Jokic to Miles Bridges and throws it down. Uh -huh. We call that get your money and put it in the bank. <laughs> Slam. It's easy to become mesmerized when you watch a player who can create off the dribble. We call that dancing. When you allow a player to dance with that much space, that's Prob City. Here comes the screen to Miles Bridges. Can't connect from inside. To Young. And that one is out. Shifting gears. Here come some substitutions. Murray into the front court. Down a bundle. To Jokic. And finishes strong. I don't think I could do that on a five-foot rim. I can, because that's my only choice. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's me and you. Me and you. Be up, baby. Double, 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 double. Stumps it down with authority. Clean up in aisle four. Repeat, clean up in aisle four. If there's anyone from the weak side that wants to participate in this game defensively, please raise your hand. Jokic. And he hits. 
we're watching the clinic right now. We're watching basketball one-on-one. -on -one. Whoever this professor is, he needs to get paid top dollar. Chicago with the possession. And a nice finish at the rim. Did you see the way that dribble freed him up? It created so much space. I did, but the defender didn't. And look out. That's what I'm talking about. Nice finish. It's all business. He takes it right at them and scores. You have to fill in there. Ooh, cool, calm, and collective. The three C's. His handles are effortless. Jokic. That is great vision to set it up. And stuffs it home. Now the Bulls will take the timeout as they'll make sure they're all on the same page here in the fourth quarter. As a player, this doesn't always happen, but it's a beautiful thing when every... is working your way. You have to really appreciate these type of moments in the game of basketball. Both coaches dipping into their reserves. Changes coming onto the floor. Bulls with the basketball. And scores. Well, we got a chance to firsthand watch something be created. I think we just watched an epidemic of passing. I've never seen something like this before. It was so contagious, everybody started to do it, and it ultimately led to the other team's demise. If that's an epidemic, Sign me up. Oh, the touch at the rim. Count it. You normally don't see that, but that's the type of thing that keeps shooters in the league for a long time. Every once in a while, they venture into the paint. Ah, oh, rock in the rim. An easy two. Get back on defense. it down with authority at this point they're twisting in the wind were you looking for a response for me because i don't really know what else there is to even say i mean is this even a game i mean we should just start packing up and getting ready to go right now bulls with the rock And a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. The offense has very little to lose on those type of plays if they know they can, number one, create contact, and number two, still get the ball up. You need to assert yourself fully on the defensive end by initiating the contact and not allowing the offensive player to get that ball above his waist. Good. Add one more to the total. This game feels out of reach. Murray with it. He'll run the offense. To Jokic. Here comes the screen. Jokic. Miles Bridges slams it down. He's been a one-man show, but Jay, they're still down in this one. He's their lone bright star, their only star tonight. Some other of the supporting cast members really need to step up. To Wendell Carter. Off the assist. Ooh, shows like this separate the good players from the great ones. The good players, they have good first halves, and then they fade the black in the second. The great players, they just sustain that kind of dynamic energy throughout the entire ball game.
to Zach Levine. Trap, 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 trap. Count the basket. Two more points in the paint. Some players are just built to absorb the contact. He pretty much dusted that defender off like that was a bug at the park. To Miles Bridges. Let's it fly from long range, trying for a 40-point night, but it's off the mark. And there's always so much talk about defense. How about offensively? If you continue to attack that shooter, now you're making him work on the defensive end that makes him take his legs away on the offensive end. take this one as they cruise to win a game that was never really in doubt that does it for my partner jay williams and our entire crew i'm ed cohen this has been a presentation of the nba on ea sports for more log on to easports.com as we say so long everyone for the EA Sports post-game wrap-up. The Bulls came away with the victory in this one. They did plenty of great things, but we all know what's going to be remembered are the dunks. And you know what? I'm going to remember nothing but the dunks as well. What you see here is how the majority of the points were scored for the Chicago Bulls. The Nuggets didn't lose big, but it was game stats. Player of the game. If you asked him, I'm sure he'd give the credit to his teammate and coaches. But at the end of the day, we know that he's the one that made the biggest impact on this game. Plays for you. Check them out. Number two. Number one.